Hello everyone, welcome to our compilation video. In case you missed any of the last 20 quizzes, you can catch up here or else you can simply revise. Let us begin. Algebra was invented by which of the following ancient Indian mathematicians? The correct answer here would be Aryabhatta. Aryabhatta wrote the Sanskrit astronomical treatise and uh, the only surviving work of his that we still have from the 5th century called Aryabhatiya. The mathematical part of it covers arithmetic, algebra, plane trigonometry and spherical trigonometry. Which of the following governor generals was impeached for charges of corruption? Correct answer here is Warren Hastings. The impeachment of Warren Hastings was a failed attempt between 1788 and 1795 to impeach the first governor general of Bengal in the parliament of Great Britain. Hastings was accused of misconduct during his time in Calcutta, particularly relating to mismanagement and personal corruption. The prosecution was led by Edmund Burke and became a wider debate about the role of the East India Company and the expanding empire in India. Razia Sultan acceded to the throne of Delhi in which year? Correct answer is 1236 AD. Razia Sultan, uh, who was the Sultana of Delhi from 10th October 1236 to 14th October 1240. A member of Mamluk dynasty, she is known for being the only female ever to rule the Delhi Sultanate and the only female ruler of Delhi. Who among the following died in consequence of falling from his horse playing Chogan? Chogan is a version of modern day polo. And the correct answer here is Kutubuddi Naibak. Kutubuddi Naibak was the founder of the Mamluk dynasty and the first sultan of the Delhi Sultanate. In 1210, he died in an accident while he was playing Chogan. He fell from a horse and was severely injured. He was buried in Lahore near the Anarkali Bazaar. He was succeeded by Shamsuddin Iltumish, another slave who rose to the level of a sultan, thus extending the slave dynasty. Kaviraja or king of poets was a title of who? Correct answer is Samudra Gupta. Samudra Gupta also liked playing the lute and loved listening to poems. He was titled Kaviraj for his love of poems. Nickel and iron are the main constituents of what? Correct answer is earth core. The iron nickel alloy that composes the inner core is heavier than other elements in the mantle and outer core, causing it to sink to the center of the earth. Since both iron and nickel are attracted to magnets, Earth's magnetic field drew the metals into the inner core, mixing them into the alloy. Lithosphere includes the crust and the uppermost mantle, which constitute the hard and rigid outer layer of the planet in the range of 0 to how many kilometers? So, lithosphere extends up to 200 kilometers. So, uh, Earth's lithosphere includes the crust and the uppermost mantle. And uh, it is subdivided into tectonic plates. What is India's global rank in sugar production? Correct answer is second. Brazil holds the first position. Madhesi National Liberation Fund belongs to which of the following countries? Correct answer is Nepal. It is also known as the Jantantrik Terai Mukti Morcha. It's a terrorist organization claiming to be a revolutionary organization in Nepal. It was formed in 2004 and it's a split from the ne Nepal Communist Party. Many a times we read in newspapers about qualified institutional placement. This is primarily used by companies for which of the following? Correct answer is raising capital. It is a capital raising tool in which a listed company can issue equity shares, debentures or any security other than warrants which are convertible to equity shares to a qualified institutional buyer. Which among the following is not correctly matched? Among these options, the incorrect match is a maxilla to cranial bone. Maxilla is actually a facial bone. It is the upper fixed bone of the jaw formed from the fusion of two maxillary bones. Which among the following is not correctly matched? Among these options, place where Prophet Muhammad was buried is not Mecca. In fact, he was buried at Medina. Which among the following is not correctly matched again? Among these options, the incorrect matches Sursen to Kosambi. Sursen was capital of Mathura and capital of Kosambi was Vatsa. Which among the following is not correctly matched? Among these options, 
Satvahana dynasty and Gautami Putra Satkarni is not the correct match. In fact, uh, the founder of Satvahana dynasty was Simu and not Gautami Putra Satkarni. Which among the following is not correctly matched? In these options, Patsha Ghazi and Aurangzeb is the incorrect match. In fact, Patsha Ghazi was the title assumed by Jahangir. Which among the following sentence is incorrect? Among the given options, the option C which states Balban completed the construction of Qutub Minar is incorrect. In fact, Il Tutmish completed the construction of Qutub Minar. Which among the following is not correctly matched? Here, Gugamal National Park, which is matched with Rajasthan, is incorrect. In fact, this park is in Maharashtra. Which among the following is an incorrect match? The correct answer here would be Laos to Tenge. So, uh, Laos's currency is in fact Kip and Tenge is the currency of Kazakhstan. Which among the following is an incorrect match? correct answer is ISO 9000 to computers. ISO 9000 is a family of standards for quality management systems and not particularly related to computers. Which among the following is an incorrect match? Here, Chandra Prabha to Haridwar is an incorrect match. The Chandra Prabha Wildlife Sanctuary is in Varanasi. The highest peak in the Western Ghats in India, highest point in South India and also the highest point in India outside the Himalaya Karakoram system is Anamudi, Kerala. So Anamudi is a mountain uh, located in the Indian state of Kerala. It is the highest peak in the Western Ghats in South India at an elevation of 2,695 meters and a topographic prominence of 2,479 meters. It lies on the border of Devikulam Taluk Idduki district and Kothamangalam Taluk, Ernakulam district. Shale is an example of what? The correct answer is it's an example of sedimentary rock. It's a fine grained clastic sedimentary rock composed of mud that is a mix of flakes of clay mineral and tiny fragments of other minerals, especially quartz and calcite. Shale is characterized by breaking along thin laminae or parallel layering or bedding less than 1 cm in thickness called facility. Which among the following are constituents of institutional credit delivery system in India? Correct answer is regional rural bank, commercial banks and cooperative credit institutions. The institutional credit has been conceived to play a pivotal role in the agricultural development of India. However, the persistence of money lenders in rural credit market is still a major concern. The shape of Vibrio bacteria is, correct answer, it is comma shaped. Vibrio is a genus of gram-negative bacteria possessing a curved rod shape, several species of which can cause foodborne infections, usually associated with eating undercooked seafood. In which of the following countries the first stock exchange opened? Correct answer is Netherlands. The first stock exchange was in Netherlands when the Dutch East India Company issued the first shares of the Amsterdam Stock Exchange. In which year Government of India approved national policy for farmers? Correct answer is 2007. Government implemented the national policy for farmers in 2007, which aimed to improve economic viability of farming and increase net income of farmers. A system in which a society consisting of a number of farmers owns land which is divided into smaller holdings and then leased to individual members of the society comes under which of the following? Correct answer is cooperative tenant farming. It is a society which purchases or leases in land form the government or some private persons and then in turn leases out the land to its members. The members cultivate the land and pay the rent falling to their share to the society. National Tiger Conservation Authority was constituted in which year? Correct answer is 2005. The National Tiger Conservation Authority was established in December of 2005 following a recommendation of the Tiger Task Force constituted by the Prime Minister of India for reorganized management of Project Tiger and the many tiger reserves in India. START or Strategic Arms Reduction Treaty is a series of treaties negotiated between which of the two nuclear powers of the world? Correct answer is US and Russia. START was a bilateral treaty between the United States of America and the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics 
on the reduction and limitation of strategic offensive arms. The treaty was signed on 31st July 1991 and entered into force on 5th December 1994. Valmiki National Park or Valmiki Tiger Reserve is located in which of the following states? Correct answer is Bihar. Valmiki National Park, Tiger Reserve and Wildlife Sanctuary is located at the India-Nepal border in the West Champaran district of Bihar, India on the bank of river Gandak. It is the only national park in Bihar. In which of the following diseases nerve cells are affected? Correct answer here is polio. When polio virus multiplies in the nervous system, the virus can destroy nerve cells which activate skeletal muscles. In the most severe cases, polio virus attacks the motor neurons of the brain stem, reducing breathing capacity and causing difficulty in swallowing and speaking. The cork cells are impervious to water, which among the following is responsible for giving this quality to cork. Correct answer is suberin. Suberin, cutin and lignins are complex higher plant epidermis and periderm cell wall macromolecules forming a protective barrier. Suberin, a complex polyester bipolymer is lipophilic and composed of long chain of fatty acids called suberin acids and glycerol which effectively means that it is attracted to fat or lipo and hence repels water. Which among the following makes the cornea transplantation easy and used more widely? Correct answer is cornea does not link up with blood vessels. Corneal transplantation is a surgical procedure where a damaged or diseased cornea is replaced by donated corneal tissues. When the entire cornea is replaced, it is known as penetrating keratoplasty and when only part of the cornea is replaced, it is known as lamellar keratoplasty. Rumen is a part of which organ? Correct answer is stomach. The rumen in stomach is composed of four separate compartments. Food passes first into the rumen, then reticulum, then a masum, and finally into the abomasum before entering the duodenum. The rumen in stomach occupies most of the left hand side of the abdomen. It is a vast structure holding up to 60 liters in an adult cow. Which among the following correctly defines Greater Mekong subregion? Correct answer is it is a development project. Greater Mekong subregion is not a geological region but a development project of the Asian Development Bank of 1992 that includes riparian states of Mekong River Basin, which is Cambodia, Laos, Myanmar, Thailand. Vietnam and the Yunnan province of China. Which among the following is located in Peace Palace in Hague, Netherlands? Correct answer is International Court of Justice. The International Court of Justice, sometimes called the World Court, is the principal judicial organ of the United Nations. It settles legal disputes submitted by states and gives advisory opinions on legal issues referred by authorized UN organs and specialized agencies. In which year International Criminal Court was established? Correct answer is 2002. So International uh, Criminal Court was established in 2002, July 1st. Rome Statute of the International Criminal Court is a treaty that established it. Which among the following international institutions was jointly established by World Meteorological Organization and United Nations Environment Programme? Correct answer is Intergovernmental Planet on Climate Change. The Intergovernmental Planet on Climate Change is an intergovernmental body of the United Nations dedicated to providing the world with an objective, scientific view of climate change, its natural, political and economic impacts and risks, and possible response options. While studying the clean development mechanism, we read about CEU, which is a standard unit comprising 1 million cubic ton of carbon dioxide. What is the correct full form? Correct answer is certified emission units. Certified emission reductions are a type of emission units issued by the clean development mechanism, executive board for emission reduction achieved by CDM projects and verified by your designated operational entity under the rules of the Kyoto Protocol. Which among the following country has strictest blasphemy law? Correct answer is Pakistan. 
the Pakistan Penal Code, which is the main criminal code of Pakistan, punishes blasphemy against any recognized religion, providing penalties ranging from a fine to death. From 1967 to 2014, over 1,300 people have been accused of blasphemy, with Muslims constituting most of those accused. Who among the following assumed the title of Mahendra Ditya? Correct answer is Kumara Gupta 1. Kumara Gupta 1 was also known as Chakra Ditya or Mahendra Ditya, was an emperor of the Gupta period in 415 to 455 CE. He was the son of his predecessor Chandra Gupta II and Dhruva Devi. He was an able ruler and retained intact the vast empire which extended from Bengal to Kathiawar and from the Himalayas to the Narmada. Which among the following is not true about C. Raja Gopalachari? Correct answer is that he served as the Premier of Bombay Presidency. This is incorrect. He served as Premier of Madras Presidency and Governor of West Bengal. Indian National Congress was founded during whose term among the following in 1885? Correct answer is Lord Dufferin. Lord Dufferin served as Governor General of India and Viceroy from 1884. To 1888. During his tenure, the Third Burmese War led to annexation of whole of Burma and Burmese ruler was exiled to India. Who among the following was Commander-in-Chief of India between 1902 and 1909 and is noted for large-scale reforms, the greatest of which was the merger of three armies of the presidencies into a unified force? Correct answer is Lord Kishnan. He is also known for reconstruction of the disorganized Indian army against the wishes of then Viceroy Lord Curzon. Adi Granth was compiled by which of the following Sikh Gurus in India? Correct answer is Guru Arjan Dev. Guru Arjan was the first of two Gurus martyred in the Sikh faith and the fifth of the ten total Sikh Gurus. He compiled the first official edition of Sikh scripture called the Adi Granth which later expanded into the Guru Granth Sahib. Who among the following was a member of Simon Commission, who subsequently became the British Prime Minister and later was to oversee the granting of independence to India and Pakistan in 1947? Correct answer is Clement Attlee. So, the Indian Statutory Commission was commonly referred to as the Simon Commission, was a group of seven British members of Parliament under the chairmanship of Sir John Simon. One of its members was Clement Attlee, who became committed to Indian independence by 1934 and achieved that goal as Prime Minister in 1947 in the granting of independence to India and Pakistan. Who was Prime Minister of England when Simon Commission came to India? to review the working of Government of India Act 1919. Correct answer is Stanley Baldwin. Stanley Baldwin was a British Conservative Party statesman who dominated the government of the United Kingdom between the world wars, serving as Prime Minister on three occasions. Year 1674 AD marks which of the following important events of life of Shivaji? The correct answer is his coronation. Shivaji was formerly crowned Chhatrapati meaning Lord of the Umbrella, on June 6, 1674 at Raigar Fort and given the title Kshatriya Kulavantas Sinha Sanadeshwar Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj. The city of Azimabad, which was abandoned since 7th century AD, was revived by Sher Shah Suri and thus he founded modern-day Patna. So the city of Patna was known as Azimabad during the 18th century prior to the British Raj. In ancient times, it was known as Pataliputra. Sher Shah Suri had removed his capital from Bihar Sharif to Pataliputra not long after Sher Shah Suri's death in 1545, Patna and Bihar fell to the Mughals. For which of the following, Sher Shah is not known? Correct answer is introducing the system of education by canals. He is known for organizing the system of civil administration and issuing first rupaya, which was used till 20th century. Uh, Sher Shah, by the dint of his military skills, daring acts, great courage and resourcefulness, not only established a mighty empire, but also by his shrewd capacity for organizing unique forethought and intimate knowledge of administration, made necessary arrangements for smooth and efficient administration and controlling the coveted empire. Which among the following was set up by RBI in 1988 
jointly with the public sector banks and all India financial institutions to develop the money market and provide liquidity to money market instruments as sequel to Vakul Working Group recommendations. Correct answer is Discounted Finance House of India Limited or DFHI. DFHI was incorporated in March 1988 and it commenced operation in April. The main objective of this money market institution is to facilitate smoothening of the short-term liquidity imbalances by developing an active secondary market for the money market instruments. Its authorized capital is Rs. 250 crores. Which among the following correctly defines Hundi? Correct answer is, they are key instruments of credit in the unorganized money market in India. A Hundi is a financial instrument that developed in medieval India for use in trade and credit transactions. Handies are used as a form of remittance instrument to transfer money from place to place as a form of credit instrument or IOU to borrow money and as a bill of exchange in trade transactions. Which among the following helps RBI to manage liquidity conditions in the economy with banks having an avenue to surplus funds or avail funds? Correct answer is repos. Repos are money market instruments which allow banks and financial institutions to sell security to an investor with an agreement to repurchase at the convenient time. Which among the following sentences is true? The correct answer among these options is that RBI introduced repos in 1992 and reverse repos in 1996. Currently, in February 2019, repo rate has been cut by 25 BPS by RBI in its 6 bi monthly monetary policy. As we know that RBI has two departments, issue department and banking department, which among them is responsible for maintaining a minimum reserve system against printing of currency rolls. Correct answer is issue department. So, the RBI offices where issue department is functioning offer the facility to members of the public to exchange their notes including soiled and mutilated notes and coins including uncurrent or worn out coins. The bank is committed to provide exchange facility free of cost at its counters during business hours. What is the main function of banking department of Reserve Bank of India? Correct answer is to issue the currency in circulation and its withdrawal from circulation. The main function of the banking department of RBI includes monetary authority, formulates, implements and monitors India's monetary policy, the main objective of which are maintaining price stability, ensuring adequate flow of credit to productive sectors and financial stability as well. Which among the following is correct regarding BPLR or benchmark prime lending rate? Among the giving options, Option A which states it is lowest interest rate below PLR charged by your bank from the best customer of the financial year is the correct option. So benchmark prime lending rate is the rate at which commercial banks charge their customers who are most credit worthy. Which among the following is correct regarding progressive tax? Correct answer is rate of tax increase for increased value or volume. A progressive tax is a tax that imposes a lower tax rate on low-income earners compared to those with a higher income, making it based on the taxpayer's ability to pay. That means it takes a larger percentage from high-income earners than it does from low-income individuals. Which among the following coined the term second-generation reforms? Correct answer is International Monetary Fund. The term second generation reform is being increasingly used in India also by ministers, mandarins and the media to refer to a general continuation of the process of economic reform and liberalization initiated by the center at the behest of the International Monetary Fund in the early 1990s. Many a times we read in newspapers about cartel, which among the following is the appropriate definition of cartel. Correct answer is association of producers to regulate prices by restricting output and competition. A cartel is a group of producers that work together to protect their interests. Cartels are created when a few large producers decide to cooperate with respect to aspects of their market. Once formed, cartels can fix prices for members so that competition on price is avoided. Which of the following is a gymnosperm? Correct answer is Chilgoza. So a gymnosperm is also known as a acrogymnosperm. Eh? It, uh, these are a group of seed producing plants that include conifers, cycads, ginkgo and netophytes. 
The term gymnosperm comes from the Greek word meaning naked seeds. The name is based on the unenclosed condition of their seeds. Artificial kidney or blood dialyzer which is used in renal failure or kidney disorders works on the principles of what? Correct answer is diffusion and osmosis. A dialysis machine and a special filter called an artificial kidney or a dialyzer are used to clean the blood. To get the blood into the dialyzer, the doctor needs to make an axis or entrance into the blood vessels. Section 28A of the Representation of the People Act provides for registration of political parties by the Election Commission of India. This act was enacted in which year? Correct answer is 1951. So, it states the returning officer, assistant, returning officer, presiding officer, polling officer and any other officer appointed under this part and any police officer designated for the time being by the state government for the conduct of any election shall be deemed to be on deputation to the election commission for the period commencing on and from the end of the notification calling for such election and ending with the date of declaration of the results of such election and accordingly such officers shall during that period be subject to the control, superintendence and discipline of the election commission. Article 326 of Indian Constitution originally granted electoral franchisee to every Indian citizen who has not been declared a bankrupt, criminal, insane or a non-resident and has attained the age of watch. So, uh, the original age was 21 years which was later revised to 18 years. Uh, Article 326 of the Constitution provides that the elections to the House of People and to the Legislative Assembly of every state shall be on the basis of adult suffrage. That is to say, a, a person should not be less than the age of 18 currently. Previously, it used to be 21 years. Consider the following reasons for malnutrition in India, which is responsible for half of the child deaths in India. Number one, low weight at birth time, which is because of poor, or poor nutrition of the pregnant woman or the mother. Number two, poor hygienic conditions. Number three, improper feeding practices, which among the above are the major reasons behind the malnutrition problem. Correct answer is all three. One of the major causes of malnutrition in India is also economic inequality, which leads to all these three reasons. Due to the low social status of some population groups, their diet often lacks in both quality and quantity. Women who suffer malnutrition are less likely to have healthy babies. Consider the following statements. Number one, in India, Uttar Pradesh is the largest producer state of cereals. Number two, Andhra Pradesh is the largest producer of rice in India. And number three, Gujarat is the largest producer of groundnuts in India. Which among the above sentences is or are correct? Answer 1 and 3 only. So, Uttar Pradesh is actually the largest producer state of cereals in India and Gujarat is the largest producer of groundnuts. However, Andhra Pradesh is not the largest producer of rice in India. So, uh, it is called the rice bowl of India but the largest producer of rice in India is West Bengal. Consider the following sentences. Number 1. Madhya Pradesh has the largest number of cattle in India. Number 2. Uttar Pradesh has the largest number of buffaloes in India. And number 3. Rajasthan has the largest number of sheep in India. What are the correct sentences among these? Only 2 and 3. That is, Uttar Pradesh has the largest number of buffaloes in India. And Rajasthan has the largest number of sheep in India. But uh, number 1. Madhya Pradesh has the largest number of cattle in India is not true. In fact, Bihar and Jharkhand have the largest number of cattle, which is about 24.6 million and about 12.4% of total cattle in India. Find out the correct pair among the four, uh, below three. One, thiamine to beriberi. Number two, vitamin D to rickets. And number three, vitamin K to sterility. Select the correct options. Only thiamine to beriberi and vitamin D to rickets is correct. Vitamin K is not linked to sterility. In fact, vitamin K is related to blood coagulation, whereas uh, vitamin E is related to sterility. Consider the following persons associated with dances in India. Number 1. Sonal Man Singh to Odissi. Number 2. Yamini Krishnamurti to Kathakali. And 3. Rukmani Devi to Bharatnatyam. Among the given pairs, 1 and 3 is correct. So, Rukmani Devi indeed is connected to Bharatnatyam and Sonal Man Singh to Odissi. 
However, uh, Yamini Krishnamurti is not associated with Kathakali but Kuchipudi. Consider the following statements regarding the rupee dollar exchange rate in the light of purchasing power parity. Number one, exchange rate of the currency should be equal to the ratio of price levels in the two countries. Number two, exchange rate of currencies should not be equal to the ratio of price levels in the two countries. Number three, exchange rate of the currencies should be decided on the basis of value of the third major currency like euro. Which among the above statements are correct? Among these, only number one is correct. So, exchange rate of currencies should be equal to the ratio of price levels in two countries. So, whatever commodities co cost, that is the purchasing power, it depends on that. So, purchasing power is determined in each country based on its relative cost of living and inflation rates. Purchasing power plus parity equalizes the purchasing power of two differing currencies by accounting for differences in inflation rates and cost of living. Which among the following article deals with the rights of citizens of certain persons of Indian origin residing outside of India? Correct answer is Article 8. It provides that any person who or either of whose parents or grandparents were born in India as defined in Government of India Act of 1955 and who is ordinarily residing in any country outside India shall be deemed to be a citizen of India if he has registered as an Indian citizen by the diplomatic or consular representative of India in that country on an application made by him or her in the prescribed form to such diplomatic or consular representative whether before or after the commencement of the constitution. In which among the following year the PIO card which is persons of Indian origin card was launched? Correct answer is 1999. Persons of Indian origin card was a form of identification issued to a person of Indian origin who held a passport in a country other than Afghanistan, Bangladesh, Bhutan, China, Iran, Nepal, Pakistan and Sri Lanka. So these are the countries that were exempted. Which among the following best supported the idea of inclusion of fundamental rights in our constitution? Correct answer is Sapru Committee Report on Constitutional Proposals 1945. So, this committee recommended that fundamental rights must be included in the Constitution of India. This committee divided fundamental rights into two parts, justifiable rights and non-justifiable rights. The justifiable rights were those enforceable by a court of law. These enforceable rights were incorporated in the part 3 of the Constitution. The non-justifiable rights were incorporated as a directive to state to all measures to provide those rights to individuals without any guarantee. They were incorporated in the part 4 of the constitution and were called directive principles of state policy. The writ of mandamus is available for purpose of which of the following? Number 1. Enforcement of fundamental rights. Number 2. Compelling a court or judicial tribunal to exercise its jurisdiction when it has refused to exercise it. Number 3. Directing a public official or the government not to enforce a law which is unconstitutional. Which is the correct option? Correct option is all three. So, mandamus means we order. This writ is applicable in all of the given statements in this question. The writ of prohibition issued by Supreme Court or High Court is issued against who? Correct answer is judicial or quasi-judicial authorities. A writ of prohibition is issued primarily to prevent an inferior court or tribunal from exceeding its jurisdiction in cases pending before it or acting contrary to the rules of natural justice. Its object is on the contrary to arrest the inferior tribunal's proceedings. We command is a literal meaning of which of the following. We just went through this in the second last question. So it is Matamus. The executive power of the Indian Union lies with which of the following? Correct answer, the president. Executive power of the union is vested in the president and is exercised by him either directly or through officers subordinate to him in accordance with the constitution. Supreme command of defense forces of the union also vests in him. Which among the following is not a correct requisite qualification for a presidential candidate? Number, uh, option number D is that which is must be a member of either house of parliament. The president is not elected member or a chosen member of either houses of the parliament. However, the other three options would say he must be less than 35 years of age, must not hold the office of profit and must be eligible to become a member of the Lok Sabha. These are all correct. 
the following members of the electoral college electing the president so the electoral uh, electoral college is uh, a indirect body which is uh, which uh, votes for the president of india correct answer here is this contains the elected members of the rajya sabha lok sabha and state assemblies so the president is indirectly elected by means of the electoral college consisting of the elected members of parliament of india and the legislative assemblies of the state and the union territories of delhi and pondicherry if there is a dispute in presidential election it will be referred whom among the following so it will get referred to the supreme court an election to the office of the president can be called in question by means of an election petition presented to the supreme court after the election is over such election petition should be presented by a candidate or 20 or more electors joined together as petitioners and may be presented at any time after the date of the publication of the declaration there shall be a president of india which article says this correct answer is article 52 Article 52 of the Indian Constitution says that there shall be a president of India. President is elected by the electoral college of elected members of both houses of parliament, elected members of state legislature, elected members of state assemblies of Delhi and Pondicherry as added by the 70th amendment act 1992. No amount from the consolidated fund of India can be withdrawn without the authorization from who? Correct answer is parliament. the government needs all its expenditure including loan repayments from this fund no amount can be withdrawn from the fund without the authorization of the parliament this fund is formed under the provision of article 2661 of the indian constitution the contingency fund of india was constituted by an act called contingency fund act of india act so in which year was this passed the correct answer is 1950 Accordingly parliament enacted the contingency fund of india act in 1950 the fund is held by finance secretary department of economic affairs on behalf of the president of india and it can be operated by any executive action konark temples are related to which of the following dynasties correct answer is ganga dynasty the sun temple at konark was built in about 1250 ad by the east ganga king Narasimha Deva in order to commemorate military successes against Muslim invaders it is also known as black pagoda Chandala kings are related to which of the following temples correct answer is Khajuraho the Chandalas of Jejaka Bhukti were a royal dynasty in central india they ruled much of the bundelkhand region between 9th and the 13th centuries the chandelas are well known for their art and architecture most notably for the temples at their original capital of khajuraho mahabalipuram was a port city of which of the following dynasties correct answer is pallava the pallava dynasty was an indian dynasty that existed between 275 and 897 ce ruling a portion of southern india they gained prominence after the eclipse of the satvahana dynasty whom the pallava served as feudatories what is kharmor Correct answer is it's a rare or endangered bird found predominantly in Madhya Pradesh. It is also known as the lesser florican and lick and it is the smallest uh, bird in the bustard family and the only member of genus Cyphotides. It is endemic to the Indian subcontinent where it is found in tall grasslands and is best known for leaping breeding displays made by the males during the monsoon season. For which of the following Bialalu is famous? Correct answer is Indian Deep Space Network. Indian Deep Space Network is a network of large antennas and communication facilities operated by the Indian Space Research Organisation to support the interplanetary spacecraft missions of India. Its hub is located in Bialalu, which is a village about 25 kilometers from Bangalore, India. The part 9 of the constitution which deals with panchayats is not applicable to which of the following states so it's not applicable to the northeastern states of Nagaland Meghalaya Mizoram tribal areas of Assam Tripura and hill areas of Manipur Ayush is a key feature of national rural health mission which aims to revitalize the local health traditions what does s stand for correct answer is siddha So Siddha is a system in one of the oldest systems of medicine in India. It means achievements and Siddhas were saintly persons who achieved results in medicine. 
Siddha literature is in Tamil and it is practiced largely in Tamil speaking parts of India and abroad. It is largely therapeutic in nature. Who among the following Mughal rulers took measures against the practice of Sati? Correct answer here is Akbar. Sati is an obsolete funeral custom where a widow immolates herself on her husband's pyre and takes her own life. It is unclear if a prohibition on Sati was issued by Akbar and there are claims of ban by Monserrat upon his insistence but there is no primary source which actually mentions the ban. In which of the following states the influence of Arad movement of 1931 was mostly confined to? Correct answer is Punjab. Majlis-e Aharar Islam, also known in short as Aharar, is a religious Muslim political movement in the Indian subcontinent that was formed during the British Raj on 29 December 1929 at Lahore. The group became composed of Indian Muslims disillusioned by the Khilafat movement, which cleaved closer to the Congress party. Which of the following was an Indian sage come guru and is said to have transmitted Tantric Buddhism to Bhutan and Tibet in the 8th century? Correct answer is Padma Sambhava. Padma Sambhava, which literally means lotus born, was also known as Guru Dinpoche, was an 8th century Buddhist master of the Indian continent. Who among the following was the last ruler of slave dynasty? Correct answer is Kakubat. So, uh, Moizuddin Kakabad was the 10th Sultan of the slave dynasty. He was the son of Bughra Khan, the independent Sultan of Bengal and a well-known uh, grandson of Ghiasuddin Balban. How many years did Humayun spend in exile after he lost his kingdom in Hindustan? Correct answer is uh, 12 years. So, after the birth of his son Jalaluddin Akbar in October of uh, 1542, the 34-year-old emperor was exiled from Delhi and had to uh, take refuge in his half-brother Kamran and Aksari's uh, region. Uh, but later, in 1547, he took Kabul from his brother in a bloodless takeover. And from there on, his rise began. The greatest lawgiver of ancient India was who among the following? The correct answer is Manu. Manu is found with various meanings in Hinduism. In early texts, it refers to archetypical man or to the first man. The Sanskrit term for human, Manav, means of Manu or children of Manu. In later texts, Manu is the title of name of 14 mystical Kshatriya rulers of earth or alternatively as the head of mythical dynasties that begin with each cyclic Kalpa when the universe is born anew. The title of the text Manusmriti uses this term as a prefix but refers to the first Manu, Swambhuva, the spiritual son of Brahma. The ancient city of Rajgriha, which is modern Rajgir near Patna, was built by which of the following kings? Correct answer is Bimbisara. Rajgir is a city and notified area in Nalanda district in the Indian state of Bihar. The city of Rajgir was the first capital of the kingdom of Magadha, a state that would eventually evolve into the Mauryan Empire. Its date of origin is unknown, although ceramics dating to about 1000 BCE have been found in the city. This area is also notable in Jainism and Buddhism. It was the birthplace of the 28th Jain, Tirthankara Manu Survritta, and closely associated with Arihant Mahavira and Gautam Buddha. Who among the following conspired against Ibrahim Lodi and invited Babur to invade Delhi? Correct answer is Dalat Khan Lodi. Dalat Khan Lodi was the governor of Lahore during the reign of Ibrahim Lodi, who was the last ruler of Lodi dynasty. Due to dissatisfaction with Ibrahim, Dalat invited uh, Babur to invade the kingdom. Which among the following rulers is related to market regulatory measures in medieval India? Correct answer is Alauddin Khilji. Alauddin fixed the prices for a wider range of goods including grains, clothes, slaves and animals. He banned hoarding and regrating, appointed supervisors and spies to ensure compliance with the regulations and severely punished the violators. Hindus and Muslims form one nation India. They are two eyes of India, injure one and you injure the other. Whose thoughts were these? Correct answer is Sir Syed Ahmed Khan. Syed Ahmad Takfi bin Syed Muhammad Muttaki, commonly known as Sir Syed Ahmad Khan, was a Muslim pragmatist, Islamic reformist, philosopher of the 19th century British India, 
And the first who said about the people of India that Hindu and Muslims are the two communities that stand in the same relation to India, in which the head and the heart stand in relation to the human body, in 1884. He was born into a, a family with strong ties to Mughal courts. Syed studied the Quran and sciences within the court. He was awarded honorary LLD from the University of Edinburgh. Kandyan dance, which is a form of dance depicting the scenes from Ramayana, is a national dance of which of the following countries? Correct answer is Sri Lanka. Kandyan dance encompasses various dance forms native to the area called Kandy of Central Hills region in Sri Lanka. But today it has been widespread to other parts of the country as well. Saka year is how many years behind the Christian era? Correct answer is 78. Kanishka, who was a Kushana emperor, is credited with the initiation of Saka era on his accession to the throne in 78 AD. Which among the following in India provides refinance to state level finance corporations or state industrial development corporations or banks etc. against their loans granted to small scale units? Correct answer is Small Industries Development Bank of India. So Small Industries Development Bank of India is a development financial institution in India headquartered at Lucknow and having its offices all over the country. Its purpose is to provide refinance facilities and short-term lending to industries and serve as the principal finance institution in the micro, small and medium enterprises sector. Central Food Technological Research Institute is located at which of the following places? So this, uh, the correct answer here is Mysore and this is one of the constituent laboratories under the aegis of Council of Scientific and Industrial Research. It was opened on 21st October 1950 in Mysore, Karnataka. Which among the following test is most suitable to judge paternity? Correct answer is DNA test. DNA paternity testing is use of DNA profiling known as genetic fingerprinting to determine whether two individuals are biologically parent and child. Path was the name of which of the following characters in Mahabharata? Correct answer is Arjun. Uh, from Pritha comes the word Path. Arjun was the favorite of Lord Krishna. He lovingly used his name Path associated with his mother Pritha or Kunti. Which among the following contributes to the replenishment of soil? Correct answer is earthworm. Worms help increase the amount of air and water that gets into the soil. They break down organic matter like leaves and grass into things that plants can use. When they eat, they leave behind castings that are very valuable type of fertilizer. Earthworms are like free farm help. Garo and Khasi hills are part of which of the following ranges? Correct answer is Himalayas. The Garo Hills are part of Garo Khasi range in Meghalaya, India. They are inhabited mainly by tribal dwellers, the majority of whom are Garo people. The Khasi Hills are located east of the Garo Hills. The Khasi people are indigenous ethnic group of Meghalaya in northeast India, with a significant population in the bordering state of Assam and in certain parts of Bangladesh. Which among the following rulers belong to Mamluk dynasty? Correct answer is Balban. So, Ghiasuddin Balban was the ninth Sultan of Mamluk dynasty of Delhi. Ghiasuddin was the Wazir and heir of the last Shamsi Sultan Nasiruddin. He reduced the power of the treacherous nobility and heightened the stature of the Sultan. The following nuclear reaction makes the sun a great source of energy. Correct answer is nuclear fusion. Nuclear fusion is a reaction in which two or more atomic nuclei are combined to form one or more different atomic nuclei and subatomic particles. The difference in mass between the reactants and the products is manifested as either the release or absorption of energy. So in the sun, we have uh, helium and hydrogen atoms which usually perform this uh, reaction. Which among the following are called alternative Nobel Prize? Correct answer is Right to Livelihood Awards. The Right to Livelihood Award is an international award to honor and support those offering practical and exemplary answers to the most urgent challenges facing us today. The prize was established in 1980 by German-Swedish philanthropist Jacob von Uexkull and is presented annually in early December. For how many times Mahatma Gandhi was nominated for Nobel Peace Prize? Correct answer is five times. 
Mahatma Gandhi was nominated for the Nobel Peace Prize five times between 1937 and 1948, but never received the prize, being assassinated on 30th January 1948, two days before the closing date for the 1948 Peace Prize nominations. Traditionally, for which of the following categories, the first of Nobel Prizes are awarded each year? Correct answer is medicine. The Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine, administered by the Nobel Foundation, is awarded yearly for outstanding discoveries in the fields of life sciences and medicine. It is one of the five Nobel Prizes established in his will in 1895 by Swedish chemist Alfred Nobel, the inventor of dynamite. Brasilia Declaration is related to which of the following? Correct answer is IPSA. The IPSA Dialogue Forum is an international tripartite grouping for promoting international cooperation among uh, some countries. The Brasilia Declaration on Road Safety was the declaration through which IPSA agreed ways to halve road traffic deaths by the end of this decade. Which of the following constitutional amendment is related to right to education bill? Correct answer is 86. It states, the state shall provide free and compulsory education to all children of the age of 6 to 14 years in such manner as the state may by law determine. The state shall endeavor to provide early childhood care and education for all children until they complete the age of 6. Which among the following has been provided to scheduled tribes and other traditional forest dwellers through the Scheduled Tribes and Other Traditional Forest Dwellers Recognition of Forest Rights Act 2006? Correct answer is legal rights on forest land. The Scheduled Tribes and Other Traditional Forest Dwellers Recognition of Forest Rights Act 2006 is a key piece of forest legislation passed in India on 18 December 2006. It has also been called the Forest Rights Act, the Tribal Rights Act, the Tribal Bill and the Tribal Land Act. On which of the following dates Bali Kadivas is celebrated in India? Correct answer is January 24th. Currently, National Girl Child Day is celebrated every year on 24th of January as a national observance day for the girl child. This is to increase the awareness about, about the necessity of girls right in society, various political and community leaders speech to the public about the girl's right for the equal education and fundamental freedoms is observed. A committee on tax on agricultural wealth and income recommended a progressive agricultural holding tax in 1972. What is the name of this committee? Correct answer is K. N. Raj Committee. Uh, so the central government appointed this committee on taxation on agricultural wealth an income under the chairmanship of Dr. K. N. Raj in February 1972 to examine the question of taxation of agricultural wealth and income from all aspects. The Raj Committee submitted its, its report in October 1972. Who among the following is the first Indian to win a Booker Prize? Correct answer is V. S. Naipaul. V. S. Naipaul is the first person of Indian origin to win a Booker Prize. Salman Rushdie is the first India-born British man to win the Booker Prize, whereas Arundhati Roy is the first Indian citizen to win the Booker Prize. Interest rate policy is a part of which of the following? Correct answer is monetary policy. The policy interest rate is an interest rate that the monetary authority or central bank sets in order to influence the evolution of the main monetary variables in the economy such as consumer prices, exchange rate, or credit expansion, among others. Different countries have different policy interest rates. Which among the following is not correctly matched? So uh, the relation here is organizations and their headquarters. Option A is Association of Southeast Asian Nations to Jakarta, Asian Development Bank to Manila, European Free Trade Association to Geneva. And the correct answer is they are all correctly matched. The Association of Southeast Asian Nations is a regional intergovernmental organization comprising 10 countries in Southeast Asia. The Asian Development Bank is a regional development bank established in 1966, which is headquartered in the Ortigas Center located in the city of uh, Mandalio, Metro Manila, Philippines. The European Free Trade Association is a regional trade organization and free trade area consisting of the European states. Iceland, Liechtenstein, Norway, and Switzerland. Which among the following is not correctly matched? 
among the giving options everything is correctly matched so afghanistan is in fact the islamic republic and it is officially known as the islamic republic of afghanistan japan is a constitutional monarchy it does have a parliamentary uh, structure but it operates within its monarchy so it's a constitutional monarchy and china is led by the communist party of china and it is in fact a communist regime which among the following is not correctly matched uh, so the first three are correctly matched that is bretton woods conference did happen in 1944 antarctic treaty did happen in 1959 and convention on biological diversity happened in 1992 wto is not matched at all so here the correct answer would be world trade organization it was in fact established in 1994 april 15th and became effective on 1st january 1995 which among the following is not correctly matched so this is founders of famous gharanas of music so in the given options all of them are, cor are correctly matched the gwalior gharana is uh, the oldest khyal gharana in indian classical music and among its early masters were nanthan khan um the jaipur gharana also known as the jaipur atroli gharana is a hindustani music apprenticeship fraternity founded by alladia khan in the late 19th century the agra gharana traces its antecedents to haji sujan khan whose family was primarily that of dhrupad singers which among the following is not correctly matched among the given options all of them are correctly matched option a open sky policy it is an aviation policy and an international policy the concept calls for liberalization of the rules and regulations of the international aviation industry um operation leech was a, a operation initiated by raw with the help of indian army and paramilitary forces to assassinate the leaders of burmese rebels as an example to other groups the london declaration was declared uh, issued in 1949 by the Com commonwealth prime ministers con uh, conference and uh, on the it was on the issue of india's continued membership in the commonwealth of nations after its transition to the republican constitution it was made in london on 28th april 1949 and marked the birth of the modern commonwealth for which of the following the term paper gold is used correct answer is special drawing rights so special drawing rights are international financing instruments created in 1970 by international monetary fund to coincide with the disfavor of the us dollars as the principal currency of the world also called paper gold and sdr is neither paper nor gold but an accounting entry which among the following correctly defines fertility rate correct answer is average number of live births per 1000 women total fertility rate in simple terms refers to the total number of children born or likely to be born to a woman in a lifetime if she were subject to the prevailing rate of age specific fertility in the population about 2.1 children per woman is called replacement level fertility according to un's population division which of the following scheme was launched under the slogan garibi hatao correct answer is 20 point program it was launched by the government of india in 1975 the program was first revised in 1982 and again in 1986 gujarat has been among the front rank ranking states in the country in implementation of these reforms which among the following correctly denotes reserve money among the given options correct answer is currency in circulation plus other deposits of general public that is with rbi plus cash held with the banks plus bankers deposits with rbi so reserve money is also called central bank money monetary base base money high powered money and sometimes narrow money in the most simple language reserve money is currency in circulation plus all deposits of commercial banks with rbi One of the major objectives of fiscal policy in India has been to attain a match between the revenue receipts and revenue expenditures. So we want to balance out whatever revenue we make to whatever money we spend. Which among the following is not a measure towards achieving this objective? Correct answer is all of these options are correct. So in economics and political science, fiscal policy is the use of government revenue collection, which is mainly taxes. and expenditure which is mainly government uh, government spending to influence the economy 
fiscal policy is often used to stabilize the economy over the course of a business cycle. In India, what we are trying to achieve, uh, we are doing via efforts to slow down the growth rate in expenditures, efforts to increase tax revenue, and efforts to raise profits of the public sector undertaking. Which among the following is not a correctly match? Among the given options, uh, all of them are correct. So SEBI or the Securities and Exchange Board of India is the regulator for the securities market in India. IRDA or the Insurance Regulatory and Development Authority of India is an autonomous statutory body tasked with regulating and promoting the insurance and reinsurance industries in India. Uh, TRI or the Telecom Regulatory Authority of India is a statutory body set up by the Government of India and is the regulator of the telecommunications sector in India. Which among the following is not correctly matched? So all of them are correctly matched. Uh, the Monopolies and Restrictive Trade Practices Act 1969 aims at preventing concentration of economic power in the hands of few business houses. So this came into effect in 1970. Acting on the long-term fiscal policy, V.P. Singh, in his 1985-86 budget, cut the maximum marginal rate of income tax to 50% and reduced personal income tax lapse from 8 to 4. So this did happen in 1985. And um, Commission for Agricultural Costs and Prices is a decentralized agency of the Government of India and was established in 1965 as the Agricultural Prices Commission and was given its present name in 1985. Steady rise in the general level of prices, income, output and employment. Which among the following is the most suitable term for this definition? Correct answer is recovery. An economic recovery is the phase of the business cycle following a recession during which an economy regains and exceeds peak employment and output levels achieved prior, prior to the downturn. Which among the following is not correctly matched? Here, all of them are correctly matched. Tandon Committee submitted its report in August 1975 on working capital. So, option A is correctly matched and option B, Omkar Committee on Industrial Sickness and Corporate Restructuring submitted its report to the Ministry of Finance on July 13, 1993. Which among the following method includes planning process and plan implementation to the grassroots level? Correct answer is decentralized planning. A decentralized planned economy or decentrally planned economy is a type of economic system based on decentralized economic planning in which decision making is distributed amongst various economic agents or localized within production units. Which among the following is the main feature of democratic planning? Correct answer is flexibility. Here, there is one central authority which plans, directs and orders the execution of the plan in accordance with predetermined targets and priorities. Such planning is comprehensive and encompasses the entire economy. Planning by inducement is democratic planning. It means planning by manipulating the market. Which among the following terms comes under the applicability of abuse of public office for private gains? Among the giving options, option B, rent-seeking is the correct answer. So what is rent-seeking? Rent-seeking is an individual's or entity's use of company, organizational or individual resources to obtain economic gain without reciprocating any benefits to society through wealth creation. An example of rent-seeking is when a company lobbies the government for loan subsidies, grants or tariff protection. Which among the following? came into existence by amalgamating two agencies, the Council for Advancement of Rural Technology or CARD and People's Action for Development India or PADI. Correct answer is CAPAD. CAPAD or Council for Advancement of People Action and Rural Technology works as a nodal agency for catalyzing and coordinating the emerging partnership between voluntary organizations and the government for sustainable development of rural areas. Which of the following causes the drop of water to be in spherical shape? Correct answer is surface tension. Surface tension is responsible for the shape of liquid droplets. Although easily deformed, droplets of water tend to be pulled into a spherical shape by the cohesive forces of surface layer. In the absence of other forces including gravity, drops of virtually all liquids would be approximately spherical. 
On a smooth glass surface, the drop of water spreads while the drop of mercury remains almost spherical. What does this prove? Correct answer is cohesive forces of mercury is more than adhesive forces with glass. So when liquid water is confined in on a glass surface, for example, a thermometer tube, suppose, uh, it has a concave shape because water wets the surface and creeps up the sides. Mercury does not wet glass. The cohesive forces within the drops are stronger than the adhesive forces between the drops and glass. When two mercury drops are brought into contact, they form a single rigor drop to get which of the following? Correct answer is minimum surface area. It is the result of cohesive force acting between the liquid molecules. If water is heated, its vapor pressure will what? So take a look at the graph. The correct answer here is increase. The line on the graph shows the boiling temperature of water. As the temperature of a liquid or solid increases, its vapor pressure also increases. Conversely, vapor pressure decreases as the temperature decreases. The vapor pressure of a liquid can be measured in a lot of ways. So this is how we can graph it out to come to this conclusion. Which among the following works while we wipe with towels? So uh, when we wipe with towels, why does the liquid get soaked? Correct answer here is capillary action. So capillary action occurs because water is sticky thanks to the forces of cohesion. Water molecules like to stay close together. And the concept of addition or the fact that water molecules are attracted and stick to other substances. When we dip a towel into a glass of water, we can see that water will climb onto the towel. You can see in the image that the colored water has climbed onto the towels. A transition from the solid to gas phase with no intermediate liquid stage is called what? So direct a transition from solid to gas is known as sublimation. Sublimation is the transition of a substance directly from solid to the gas phase without passing through the intermediate liquid phase. What happens when a ship enters a sea from a river? Correct answer is it rises. So when a ship enters a sea from a river, the ship is elevated or uplifted due to the density of seawater and during the buoyant motion of the ship as it would gain both potential and kinetic energy when rising in the fluid. So basically uh, what you can remember is since seawater is denser, it pushes up the ship. When a barometer is taken down in a coal mine, which of the following happens with mercury level in the tube? Correct answer, it rises. The density of air rises as we go below sea level, hence this happens. Which among the following character of mercury makes it suitable to use in barometers instead of water? Correct answer is high density and low vapor pressure. So mercury is commonly used in barometers because it is high density and uh, it, that means the height of the column can be a reasonable size to measure atmospheric pressure. A barometer which uses water for instance would need to be 13.6 times taller than a mercury barometer to obtain the same pressure difference. Which among the following is in action in the process of a liquid rising in the syringe when the piston is pulled up? Correct answer is atmospheric pressure. So while pulling the piston, pressure inside the syringe decreases as compared to the atmospheric pressure, its tube now becomes comparatively empty. Hence, when there is liquid on the outside of the needle, it gets pulled into the empty space by the vacuum. Narasimha Varman I was one of the most famous Tamil kings of the Pallava dynasty who ruled South India and founded Mahabalipuram. His other name is Mamalla. Narasimha Varman I or Narasimha Varma I was a king of Pallava dynasty who ruled South India from 630 to 668 AD. He shared his father Mahendra Varman I's love of art and completed the work started by Mahendra Varman in Mamallapuram. Who wrote the book Neil Darpan? Correct answer is Dinabandhu Mitra. Neil Darpan is a Bengali play written by Dinabandhu Mitra in 1858 to 1859. The play was published in Dhaka in 1860 and is about the Indigo Revolt of February March 1859 in Bengal when farmers refused to sow indigo in their fields to protest against exploitative farming under the British Raj. It was translated by Reverend James Long, for which he was sentenced to prison and charged with sedition. 
among fog, hail, snowfall and rains, all are forms of precipitation except which one? Correct answer is fog. Fog is not a form of precipitation. Fog is a visible aerosol consisting of tiny water droplets or ice crystals suspended in the air at or near the earth's surface. Fog can be considered a type of low-lying cloud usually resembling stratus and is heavily influenced by nearby bodies of water, topography and wind condition. As per the Lakrawala formula, which among the following is accepted to estimate urban poverty? Correct answer is consumer price index for industrial labor. So, till as recently as 2011, the Fisher Poverty Lines were based entirely on the recommendations of the Lakra Lakrawala Committee of 1993. This poverty line was set such that anyone above them would be able to afford 2400 and 2100 calories worth of consumption in rural and urban areas respectively in addition to clothing and shelter. According to this committee, a poor is one who cannot meet these average energy requirements. In which plan integrated handloom development scheme was initiated? Correct answer is 11th. Integrated handlooms development scheme uh, was implemented during the 11th plan and has been formulated as a centrally sponsored plan scheme by merging the essential components with or without modifications of the four schemes which are Deen Dayal Hath Karga Sahan Yojana, Integrated Handloom Training Project, Integrated Handloom Cluster Development Scheme and Walk Shed Come Housing Scheme which were all implemented during the 10th plan. Doing away with which of the following articles was suggested by the Virappa Moili Commission in its report on administrative reforms among other aspects. Correct answer is Article 310 and 311. The Union Minister for Law and Justice, A. M. Virappa Moli, said in 2009 that the Centre should consider amending Articles 309, 310 and 311 of the Constitution, thus removing protection and safeguards in prosecuting corrupt public servants. Which among the following is a bird sanctuary? Correct answer is Sultanpur National Park. Sultanpur National Park and Bird Sanctuary is located in Gurgaon district of Haryana, 46 kilometers uh, from Delhi. Resident birds include the common hoopoe, Indian cormorant, common spoonbill, etc. Every year, over a hundred migratory bird species visit here to feed. In the winters, the sanctuary provides a panorama of migratory birds such as Siberian crane, greater flamingo, ruff, black winged stilt, etc. Which among the following is known as Bible of Cricket? Correct answer is wisdom. Wisden Cricketer's Almanac, or simply Wisden, or colloquially, the Bible of Cricket, is a cricket reference book published annually in the United Kingdom. What is the title of autobiography of uh, Major Dhanchand? Correct answer is Goal. Known as the wizard or the magician of hockey for his superb ball control, Dhanchand played internationally from 1926 to 1949. He scored 570 goals in 185 matches, according to his autobiography, Goal. What is the correct full form of DWCRA? Correct answer is Development of Women and Children in Rural Areas. The scheme was aimed to improve the socio-economic status of the poor women in the rural areas through creation of groups of women for income-generating activities on a self-sustaining basis. Which among the following sentences is not correct? Option B is not correct. The Second Anglo-Mysore War was not concluded by the Treaty of Wadgao. The Second Anglo-Mysore War was concluded by the Treaty of Mangalore. Which among the following pairs is not correctly matched? So the pairs are travellers to during reign of which king? Among the given options, Demachos to Ashoka is not correct. Demakos was a Greek ambassador who visited the court of Bindusara and not Ashoka. Chandradeva was the founder of which of the following dynasties? Correct answer is Gahadwalas. The Gahadwala dynasty was a power from the Indian subcontinent that ruled parts of present-day Indian states of Uttar Pradesh and Bihar during 11th and 12th centuries. The capital was located at Varanasi in the Gangetic Plains and for a brief period they controlled Kanyakupcha or modern-day Kanoj. 
Chandradeva was the first monarch of the dynasty, established a sovereign kingdom sometime between 1090 CE after the decline of Kalachuri power. Who among the following was defeated by Muhammad Ghori in Battle of Chandwar? Correct answer is Jai Chandra. The Battle of Chandwar, which was fought in the year 1193 or 1194, was fought between Muhammad Ghori and Jai Chand of Kanauj of the Gadwala dynasty. Which of the following Pala ruler founded the University of Vikramshila? Correct answer is Dharampala. Vikramshila was founded by Pala king Dharampala in the late 8th or early 9th century. It prospered for about 4 centuries before it was destroyed by Bhakti Arkhilji along with the other major centers of Buddhism in India around 1193. Who was the founder of Pala dynasty of Bengal? Correct answer is Gopala. Pala dynasty was a ruling dynasty in Bihar and Bengal from the 8th to 12th century. Its founder Gopala was a local chieftain who rose to power in the mid 8th century during a period of anarchy. Who among the following founded the principality of Khazni in AD 962? Correct answer is Alptegin. Alptegin was a Turkic slave commander of the Samanid Empire who would later become the semi-independent governor of Ghazna from 962 AD until his death in 963. Before becoming the governor of Ghazni, Alp Tegin was the commander-in-chief of the Samanid army in Khorasan. The Chandela's kingdom was annexed by which of the following rulers? Correct answer is Alauddin Khilji. The then Chandela king was then reduced in title and status to that of a local chief in 1308 or 1309 when the region was conquered by Sultan Alauddin Khilji. Which among the following was not a landmark of Iltutmish's rule? Correct answer is putting forward the divine right theory. Divine right theory was in fact put forward by Balban. Which among the following was not a landmark of Alauddin Khilji's reign? Creation of agricultural department called Divani Kohi. Uh, creation of agricultural department called Divani Kohi was a landmark of Muhammad bin Tughlaq's reign. Among Caspian Sea, Aral Sea, Black Sea and Red Sea, all are closed seas except which one? Correct answer is Red Sea. So what is a closed sea? It is also known as Mare Clausum. In international law, it is a sea or ocean or any other navigable body of water under the jurisdiction of a state that is closed or not accessible to other states. Red Sea is not uh, such a water body. Santa Ana, Brickfielder, Sirocco and Kamsin are examples of what? Correct answer is winds. The Santa Ana winds are strong, extremely dry, downslope winds that originate inland and affect coastal southern California and northern Baja, California. The brick filter is a hot and dry wind in the desert of southern Australia that occurs in the summer season. Sirocco is a Mediterranean wind that comes from the Sahara and can reach hurricane speeds in North Africa and southern Europe especially during the summer season. Kamsin is a hot, dry, dusty wind in North Africa and the Arabian Peninsula that blows from the south or southeast in late winter and early spring. Jet streams are examples of what? Correct answer is air currents. Jet streams are fast-flowing, narrow, meandering air currents in the atmospheres of some planets including Earth. On Earth, the main jet streams are located near the altitude of the topopause and the westerly winds that flow west to east. Among Japan, South Korea, North Korea, China and Russia, all border the Red Sea of Japan except which one? Correct answer is China. So look at the map. You can see that Sea of Japan is a marginal sea between the Japanese archipelago, Sakhalin and the Korean Peninsula and Russia. The Japanese archipelago separates the sea from Pacific Ocean and it is bordered by Japan, North and South Korea and Russia. However, China does not border it. The national parliament of which country is called Althing? Correct answer is Iceland. The Althing is the national parliament of Iceland. It is the oldest legislature in the world that still exists. It was founded in 930 AD in Thigvelir, which means the assembly fields. 
and uh, is 45 kilometers east of Iceland's capital Reykjavik. The People's Republic of China, commonly known as China, has control over which of the following? Correct answer is Macau. So, uh, you might think that option A is correct. The Republic of China is not actually a country. It's the People's Republic of China. So, in this case, the correct option is Macau. Macau is an autonomous region on the south coast of China across the Pearl River Delta from Hong Kong. In which of the following countries, Patriot Day is observed every year in the month of September? Correct answer is USA. In the United States, Patriot Day occurs on September 11 of each year, designated in the memory of September 11, 2001 terrorist attacks. Which among the following is not correctly matched? So these are pair, uh, pairs of countries and their national games. As it happens, all of them are correctly matched. Baseball is the national game of USA. Field hockey is that of Pakistan and table tennis that of China. Since which of the following year Winter Olympics are held? Correct answer is 1924. The Winter Olympic Games is a major international multi-sport event held once every four years for sports practiced on snow and ice. The first Winter Olympic Games was the 1924 Winter Olympics and was held in Chamonix, France. Three forms of hockey, uh, field hockey which is no known as Kong Kangjai, and a wrestling hockey known as Mukna Kangje and Sagol Kangje, which is horse hockey. The third form has been traced back as origins of modern game of polo. Which of the following northeast state is related to the origin of polo? Correct answer is Manipur. So Kong Kangje is uh, also known as uh, Kangje and commonly known as foot hockey. This is also uh, from the state of Manipur in India and uh, it is also sometimes called Manipuri hockey. Now, Sagol Kangje has been adapted and adopted by the international enthusiasts of the game as polo and is now played worldwide. Which committee on the working of the monetary system in India emphasized that real deficit should include not only the overall budgetary deficit but also the market borrowings and the liabilities giving birth to a new concept of fiscal deficit? Correct answer is S. Chakravarti Committee. S. Chakravarti or Sukhama Chakravarti Committee was formed in December 1982 under the chairmanship of Professor Sukhama Chakravarti to assess the functioning of the Indian monetary system. Its goal was to improve monetary regulation, a feat that was hoped would enable price stability. The committee, which submitted its report in April 8, 1985, believed that price stability was essential for promoting growth and achieving other social objectives. Which among the following is incorrect regarding NPA or non-performing asset? Among the given options, option C which says a loan repayment which is delayed beyond one year has to be identified as NPA is incorrect. So the time that is given is 180 days. So that's six months. A loan repayment which is delayed beyond six months has to be identified as NPA. What is the approximate height of a geostationary satellite? Correct answer is 35,000 kilometers. A geostationary equatorial orbit is a circular geosynchronous orbit in the plane of the Earth's equator with a radius of approximately 42,164 kilometers. So, a satellite which sits on this orbit is at an altitude of approximately 35,786 kilometers above mean sea level. 180 degree longitude is also known as international date line. The international date line established in 1884 passes through the mid Pacific Ocean and roughly follows a 180 degrees longitude north south line on the earth. It is located halfway around the world from the prime meridian which is the zero degree longitude established at Greenwich England in 1852. So, uh, if you see the map, the line deviates its places. So, this is because we don't want to mess up the dates in a particular country. So, what we are trying to achieve by deviating the line is to maintain a single date in a single country or uh, island. In which period of the Indian history, the Kanampa zero as well as decimal system was invented? Correct answer, Gupta. The period is called Golden Age of India 
and was marked by extensive inventions and discoveries in science, technology, engineering, art, dialectic, literature, logic, mathematics, astronomy, religion and philosophy that crystallized the elements of what is generally known as Hindu culture today. So the Gupta period was indeed a golden age of India and that's when Aryabhatta was present and uh, the discovery of the number zero happened during that time as well. Ganymede is the largest moon in the solar system. It is a satellite of planet Jupiter. Ganymede is a satellite of Jupiter and is the largest, most massive of the solar system's moons. The ninth largest object in the solar system. It is the largest without a substantial atmosphere. On which of the following dates International Literacy Day is observed every year? Correct answer is September 8th. 8th September was declared International Literacy Day by UNESCO on 26th October 1966 at the 14th session of UNESCO's General Conference. It was celebrated for the first time in 1967. It aims to highlight the importance of literacy to individuals, communities and societies and celebrations take place in several countries. Who among the following Indian economists have played a crucial role in the MNREGA, formerly known as NREGA? The correct answer is Jean Dries. So, uh, he is a Belgian-born Indian economist and activist and has worked on several developmental issues facing India like hunger, famine, gender inequality, etc. He is well known for his commitment to social justice both in India and internationally. In fact, he was recently briefly detained by Jharkhand police for his activism. And uh, since this happened, uh, in, it becomes a current affairs issue. So this question is uh, especially important for your upcoming uh, PSCs and uh, your union public service as well. Which of the following took birth with Treaty of Assantia? Correct answer is Mercosur. So Mercosur is a sub-regional bloc of South American countries. Its purpose is to promote free trade and the fluid movement of goods, people and currency. It was established in 1991 and its headquarters are located in Montevideo, Uruguay. It calls itself the common market of the South America at present. It is a full customs union and trading bloc. Its full members are Argentina, Brazil, Paraguay and Uruguay. Which of the following commodities are directly affected by the fluctuations in international rates of crude oil? The correct answer here would be gold and silver. They are directly affected by the fluctuations of gold or crude oil rate. A number of factors are responsible for poverty in India. Which among the following is not the economic factor contributing to poverty? The correct answer is inequalities of income. As of November 2016, India is the second most unequal country in the world after Russia. The richest 1% of Indians own 58.4% of wealth. The richest 10% of Indians own 80.7% of the wealth. This trend is going in the upward direction every year, which means the rich are getting richer at a much faster rate than the poor. Which of the following sentence is or are correct? Among the given options, option A. The union levies, collects and distributes the proceeds of income tax between itself and states is correct. Taxes in India are levied by the central government and the state government. Some minor taxes are also levied by the local authorities such as municipalities. Therefore, each tax levied or collected has to be backed by an accompanying law, passed either by the parliament or the state legislature. In which of the following situations, the investment will increase? The correct answer is when there is an increase in output and increase in capital stock. Over the years, India has emerged as one of the fastest growing economies in the world and an attractive investment destination driven by economic reforms and a large consumption base. It was the fastest growing major economy in 2017-18 with its GDP growing 7.2% and reaching rupees 170.95 trillion. It is expected to grow at 7% in 2018-19. Which among the following is a direct tax? Correct answer is income tax. Direct tax is a tax directly paid to the government by the individuals or organizations on whom it is imposed. The main examples are income tax, gift tax, wealth tax, etc. Which among the following is a progressive tax? Correct answer is income tax. 
In progressive taxation, the tax liability increases with individual or entity income. This is based on principle of ability to pay. Under this system, lowest income people are generally exempted while highest income people pay highest taxes. Income tax is thus an example of progressive tax. Progressive taxation results in redistribution of income from rich to poor. All commercial banks, including branches of foreign banks functioning in India, local area banks and regional rural banks are insured by DICGC. What is the full form of DICGC? Correct answer is Deposit Insurance and Credit Guarantee Corporation. So, Deposit Insurance and Credit Guarantee Corporation is a subsidiary of Reserve Bank of India and was established on 15 July 1978 under Deposit Insurance and Credit Guarantee Corporation Act 1961 for the purpose of providing insurance of deposits and guaranteeing of credit facilities. DICGC insures all bank deposits such as saving, fixed, current, recurring deposit for up to the limit of Rs 100,000 of each deposits in a bank. Which among the following is correct regarding currency chests? Correct answer is storehouses where bank notes and rupee coins are stocked on behalf of the reserve bank. So, uh, currency chests are branches of selected banks authorized by the RBI to stock rupee notes and coins. The responsibility for managing the currency in circulation is vested in the RBI. Rupees 100 notes are printed in which of the following? Correct answer is in the Indian Security Press Nasik, the Security Printing Press Hyderabad, as well as the Banknote Press in Divas. The India government mint operates four mints in the country for the production of coins. Each currency coin minted in India and anywhere else in the world has a special mint mark on it to identify the mint. Which among the following taxes is levied by state government only? Correct answer is entertainment tax. In India, entertainment tax is levied on every financial transaction that is related to entertainment such as movie tickets, major commercial shows and big private festivals. As per the Indian constitution, entertainment is included in list 2. The revenue is thus reserved primarily for the state governments. That's all for today's quiz. Until the next video, goodbye.